Okay, let's speak about audio profiles. Audio profiles, you can see uh, in the first red button. Uh, audio profiles are a uh, new of uh, is something new that uh, I introduced uh, starting from release four zero two, and uh, there was a special reason. In the passage from release 3 to release 4, some people complained about the fact that uh, they have problem with uh, the, their audio. I mean, in general, problems were uh, of two types. The first, uh, uh, when they reply to a phone call, the phone call goes automatically in um, live voice. You know, on the loudspeaker and the second problem was that they had problem anyway to connect to um, Bluetooth devices in this case the voice will go uh, on the loudspeaker again this was due to a modification that I performed uh, in release 4 uh, in order to support uh, some devices that had uh, the need to receive uh, an explicit uh, an explicit command for their loudspeaker. Unfortunately, this command was not compatible, resulting not compatible with the minority of smartphone mm, in which Android is not written so well. That's the problem, the major problem of Android is that there are so many customizations and some of them are not so good. In general, uh, at this point, uh, I have uh, uh, decided to um, to have these two profiles. The first profile that I have called standard, that there's no <laughs> reason to call it in that way, but I call it standard in the sense that it should be the most common. Uh, profile one uh, is uh, going well for the majority of the smartphone. Uh, profile 2 is needed for the one that need uh, a, uh, to manage in a different way the loudspeaker. Okay, anyway, I suggest when you upgrade uh, from a previous release, they install, in this case for sure, they install uh, the previous version, reinstall this one, the, the new one from scratch, and at the end of the installation, I suggest also switch on, switch off and switch on uh, your phone. That's the major <laughs> security at this point. Okay, well, uh, at this point to switch among uh, the two profiles, I said already before, you have just to uh, press on the first red button. Uh, if you press a third time, uh, it will come out the uh, same uh, option as before, so the forced mode in loudspeaker. In this case, uh, the smartphone will anyway try to uh, send notification to the loudspeaker. Okay, let's come back to audio profile standard. Okay, and uh, let's speak uh, a few words uh, about uh, the last two red button. Okay, the first. Uh, that uh, is anyway uh, you can activate it only if bluetooth is on okay there is the warning to be sure what you are doing uh, in this case uh, you force the device you can see also in the status man bt man force that minus bt minus force that means that it is forced in bluetooth mode uh, even if uh, you are not uh, connected to a device, this can be used if the, you have problem in the connection, but it's not suggestible in general. Uh, if you press again, you go in minus BT minus music mode, that is a Bluetooth forced mode on, a, on the music stream, on the music channel. Uh, this is a third mode, a third possible mode, very rare cases, but anyway, uh, at least one people in the world need to use this configuration to have notification on the Bluetooth channel. It is so strange, okay, I repeat, it's always due to the fact that uh, any smartphone can have a different customization of the operating system. Unfortunately, we have two 
consider also this fact okay let's go back to the normality and now the last uh, the last uh, button this is just a button to uh, test the emulate uh, the emulation of bluetooth phone call uh, that is the one that you use to communicate to send a notification to speak with uh, your car stereo for example or your la or your uh, all the rps for that support only phone call from here you can uh, simulate the opening and the closing of a phone call just to uh, test if everything is going well or to close a previous phone call that remain open okay i said everything regarding the audio profile